I'm back out for another hunt. Uh, come back to the uh, Queen Anne field. I'm just going to get all my gear on now. Um, it's just down there where I'm going to be hunting. And I'm actually going to be covering all this again at a later date. And also getting the hunt there. Right, I've been here over an hour now. Uh, I've only been digging iron, really deep iron. Uh, very frustrating. Uh, this is the third target I got to show you. Is a tiny button. Um, that's a pretty old button that. Uh, this is ringing in at 12.08. Uh, I don't think I said before, I'm using the uh, Coil Tech uh, 14 by 9 coil today. Right, on to the next. Uh, this is the area where I've been gridding. It's absolutely waterlogged here. It's a nightmare to walk through. I'm fighting a losing battle. Uh, it's it's not bad on that end. Um, I can do a bit more detecting there in a minute. Uh, at the moment, I've just come onto this raised bit, and I have this signal here, uh, um, very choppy signal. A lot of stones have come out, at, which is a nightmare. And I've had another spindle whirl, so I'm happy with that. So that's two spindle whirls off here, um, and this looks an early one as well. Um, there's no pattern on this. Which I don't think there is. I think they're just dents from the stones. I don't know, I'll give it a cleaner. Okay, next target. We're drinking in the 1220s. Another scratchy target again. That had to be dug. And it's a little pistol ball. So that's nice to find. Don't mind finding these. There you go. On to the next. Right, next target again amongst all the stones and rocks. A uh, few things came out of this hole. There's some bits of pottery. That would have a nice pattern. Probably Victorian. Um, bit of broken glass. White lead. If it's white, it's old. You can see that was used for something. There's a line on there. Um, so, no, I didn't find that. And this, I don't know what that's off. Don't know, looks like, uh, I don't know, I was going to say an end of a gun, but I don't think it is. Um, not sure. Rounded. Anyway, on to the next. That's very, very muddy here. Uh, on the side-by-side uh, -side maps, uh, I first uh, noticed this spot. Uh, this is a spring, natural spring. So you just got water coming out the ground here all the time. Never ever stops. So in ancient times, this is where they would have got their water from. Probably there would have been a better setup here than mine. Just goes down and down and down. Uh, next target, uh, very random for on here. Um, it's a dog's ID tag with a phone number. Now, there's no public footpath here. I wonder if it was one of the the owners that lived here or currently lives here. I don't know. Uh, the dog was called Junior. Our uh, next target to show you, it's looking like an old bullet. Look at that. Yeah, also, I don't mind finding stuff like this. Um, I don't know how old this is, if it's Civil War or what. But that is a nice little relic there. Don't find a lot of them here. Right, uh, there won't be many more digs now, if any more. Right, I'm totally out of time now, uh, just starting to lose light. Uh, it wasn't a very good hunt, uh, found no coins, so... But not to worry, it's all about getting out. Uh, again, the coil tech did really well today. Um, I can't give it any negative feedback. Uh, uh, people go on about the weight issue, but it's not an issue to me. That coil is perfect uh, I was also wearing my harness today uh, as well but I wasn't always bungeed up I'm fine you know without the bungee it's just comfort when you use the bungee but uh, excellent uh, spade I use is the uh, black Adder gladius spade the stainless steel one and I'll just show you my finds 
I've dug a lot of iron. Uh, the reason why I'm digging a lot of iron is because I've had a lot of good finds over the last few months amongst iron, so uh, that can was deep. Uh, see all the iron? Um, look at that old nail. That's got some age to it. It's like square. Uh, iron, iron. That was sticking up, that was, but pretty deep. I thought it was an end of a sword, but it's not. Um, some other strange bits of iron. They've all been used for something. And these are all the uh, non ferrous finds. Um, this was the last find I've just dug now. I don't know what it is. It's got some strange lines on it. I have dug something like this before with lines on it. And there was a darker patch in the middle of that one too. So, uh, I don't know. And dog tag. Uh, pistol ball, spindle whirl, probably the old, yeah, probably the oldest find today. Um, old bullet, I don't know, civil war. It's got like two rings on it. It has a uh, button, and these are just bits of uh, scrap that's non-ferrous. And that's it. No coins today. No silver. Not to worry. Uh, right, I'm going to wish you a Merry Christmas again and um, next time I'm out now I'm going to be with a Raf man and a couple of other people as well but you'll have to wait and see for that one. So thank you for watching, commenting and subscribing. I'll be uploading another video soon. Take care, all the best, good luck and happy hunting.